Hey guys, it's me, Talia Arisa Gibson. You can call me Tag for short, and welcome to my channel. <laughs> Like, comment, subscribe. All right, guys, today is Vlogmas Day 15, and again, I'm on my way to work. <laughs> but uh, today, I just uh, have a busy day at work. And then um, I do need to run a couple errands after work. Um, we've been having these themed days at work. And so like today uh, we're supposed to wear holiday hats and I have my holiday hat. I'll take a picture or show you uh, when I put it on. But yesterday we were supposed to wear red or green. And so I did that. Uh, tomorrow I think we're supposed to wear like lights, something with lights on, like a lighted necklace or lighted shirt or hat or whatever it might be and so I don't have anything that's lighted so I need to look for something I looked when I was at a couple of stores uh, this weekend and I didn't see anything and so I'll need to just kind of check around and see if I can find something or make something to work for tomorrow's theme and then after that is um, I think on Thursday is ugly sweater day and I don't have an ugly sweater which I need one because I'm going to an event on uh, Thursday, no, Friday. Um, it's a trap and paint event, which is uh, where they play music, uh, like hip hop music and stuff like that. And then you paint and uh, you wear your ugly sweaters, you can get food and it's fun. And so I don't have a sweater, so I need to get one for that. So whatever one I find for Thursday, I'll wash it and wear it on Friday <laughs> um, but yeah so and then I think Friday is like pajama day or holiday pajama day but I don't think I'm gonna wear pajamas on Friday because I feel like I always have like things to do after work or errands to run and I just don't want to forget that I have pajamas on and go try to go to a store <laughs> but anyways guys I'm gonna focus on driving and I will see you all later Guys, I am back from work and I had to go run some errands and I just wanted to show you what I am up to. Um, I have here some treats that I'm preparing for work. Um, I already did some, um, but I need to do a couple more today. But I also have some hot chocolate. And so I wanted to, I saw this little uh, marshmallow cocoa coaster and so I thought I would enjoy some cocoa while I kind of tell you what I am up to and so um, I have my cute little mug that I got from where did I get this from I think I got it from did I get it from Target hmm I can't even remember but I like it because it has the print that I have on my tree and on my decorations and so um and you would think that my favorite color is red but i like to decorate with red it's not my favorite color though um comment down below if you can guess my favorite color <laughs> okay so i'm gonna pour some cocoa in here So this is the cocoa that I'm using. I saw this at Target. It's a Ghirardelli hot cocoa mix, double chocolate. And so I put some hot milk and poured this in and mixed it up. And so I have my hot chocolate. And so I don't know if you could see that. I don't wanna spill it. Yeah, you can't see it. <laughs> but um, cheers. <laughs> have a cup with me, join me. Mmm, that's good. So, I have some little treats here that I'm just preparing for um, coworkers. So, like, I have um, some candy canes here, the cherry candy canes. Um, I have these look like they'd be pretty good. Um, the Lindor chocolates. It has uh, milk with white. Uh, milk chocolate truffles and then I have 
these squares peppermint bark from Ghirardelli and these are good I've had these before I haven't tried um, this one I don't think but I've had a lot of the other ones and so and then um, I got these at at Dollar Tree and they're Palmer peppermint bark it has dark chocolate at the bottom and pepper peppermint bark I'll show you but these little things are so good I ate three of them already <laughs> but they're so good um so <laughs> um so let's get this little stir in there it, it's a marshmallow cocoa stir it's white chocolatey coated with marshmallows and so let's see mm, that looks good couple of loose marshmallows I'll put those in there let's give this a stir you can see the steam can you see that Woo! <laughs> yum oh the marshmallows are going off in there let's see what this tastes like It's really just white chocolate with marshmallows. Mm -hmm. That's good. Mm. Sugary goodness. What I'm doing is I'm making some cards for, and these are some of the cards I have. Um, but I'm making cards for coworkers. I already did like some for all of the teachers. And so now I'm trying to work on like secretaries and office staff and things like that. So, um, this one says peace and joy to you this Christmas season. Just simple cards. So let's see. I'm going to um, give this one to our uh, school counselor. Um, um, so it says peace and joy to you this Christmas season. So I put her name and then I'm going to say um, thank you for all you do for students and helping uh, staff Remember to take care of ourselves. So she always like promotes like um, social emotional health for not just students, but for teachers and staff members. So thank you for all you do for students and helping staff. Remember to take care of ourselves. Um, have a restful and relaxing winter break. I'm going to say um, blessings. That's how I've been signing all of them, blessings. And Talia Gibson. All right. So that's cute. All right. So I have my envelope. And I am going to put it in there. And 
And so then I'm gonna just put her name on the outside. So then what I'm gonna do is take a candy cane and get in here without breaking them. I hate when they're broken. So I'll take a candy cane and then I'm gonna stick it on the envelope and have some tape. on there to seal it and so I have a little gift so I'll hand um there's the little candles and I'm waiting for them to get here they should be here tomorrow I'm gonna give um or make these little candle bags so I'll give a candle um and then a little sweet treat which one do you think I should give her this one or the peppermint bark maybe this one I think it's cute but um so I'll give the card covering the name <laughs> and a a sweet treat and then um, the little candle so just some um, simple uh, cute like inexpensive gifts just to show um, that you're thinking of and I thought the holiday cards always great and I try my best to sign them and this year I put little notes in everybody and this is over goodness it's by the time I'm done it will be almost like 50 cards that I hand signed with the little note just saying like have a great um, holiday and stuff like that. So um, just something simple, but just shows your coworkers that you're thinking about them, especially in the environment that I work in. I don't know about you all, but I just think it's thoughtful and hopefully you have a positive working environment. For those of you who are entrepreneurs and have your own business, or if you're doing YouTube full time, um, that's amazing too. Um, I guess you you are your own coworker, so you can treat yourself. <laughs> to um, a gift. I'm not gonna eat all this um, chocolate off of this stick. Cause that's, it's a lot of sweet. But um, I like that it melts a bit in the hot chocolate. Uh, Cause this hot chocolate's not too sweet. It's more, I think it's um, a dark hot chocolate. Let me see. No, it says double chocolate mix unsweetened chocolate it does have some sugar probably more sugar than I would want I'm not gonna tell you how much sugar because you don't need to know <laughs> you get one yourself and then you can judge me <laughs> but yeah that's this is definitely not something you want to have all the time and then this thing is probably full of well it is full of sugar <laughs> Well, guys, I hope that your week has been going great and that you are staying in good spirits. I know, again, I keep saying this, but this time of year, people can get really down because of loss of loved ones or because of just life circumstances or just feeling alone or like they don't have anyone to celebrate the season with. But I hope you're celebrating it with me and I hope that you have um, other YouTubers that you're watching and they're helping you smile too. I know I've been enjoying uh, the Vlogmas videos and not even just that, but like the Mukmas videos. And then those who are just posting like once or twice a week, just posting content. So I really appreciate all of my fellow YouTube family. Um, some really cool people. I've just enjoyed learning about some new content creators. And so, you know, you have your veterans and the people that you watch consistently, but you also have the people that you're discovering. And that's also a lot of fun. Um, this morning, I was uh, watching um, Tosh Point Fro. She's a veteran for sure. But I, for some reason, I don't know, like, how but i was unsubscribed from her and i know that i was subscribed i believe because i watched her all the time and like i was like why does it say that i need to subscribe to her channel but she doesn't post 
as regularly anymore because I know she has a lot going on. But she actually lives um, here in the Dallas area now. I think she's still living here, but um she has some good videos um one of my videos from Sir a while wow wow while back <laughs> um i did the hot cheeto fried pickles and she's very known for doing those and hers looks so perfect and um, when i used her recipe mine came out really really good and so i will have to do those again that's something you definitely don't want to eat all the time but it was really good so i'm gonna have to do those on the channel again but i was watching her it was kind of like nostalgic because i started watching her um i think 2019 or so uh, yeah i think it was around 2019 and um she's definitely doing well and uh has other ventures that she's doing beyond youtube but i was happy to um come across some of her videos again because i was like why am i not seeing her on my feed but she hadn't been posting very regularly and so that's why but also somehow i was unsubscribed from her and so who knows how i did that but yeah i appreciate all of you i hope that you enjoyed this short video but i just wanted to show you um just some things to think about it doesn't have to be a big gift um i'm gonna give these little candles that i got that are really cute um and i'll i'll kind of pick the scents based on the person and what i think they will like and so I know I'm picky about scents and so I'll definitely consider that when I'm giving people um, the little candles too. But they're cute candles and so um, I like the, even if they don't use them, they, it could just be like a decoration. But I like giving gifts. I think it's fun and it's better to give than to receive. I don't care about receiving a lot of material things really. I'm just like, I really like to travel um, and I want to do more traveling and uh actually use my passport <laughs> and so um that's my goal and i like to go out to eat i like to go listen to live music i have tickets i got my ticket to jasmine sullivan she is one of my all-time favorites all-time favorites um r&b singers um she's one of them and i have many that i really love including brandy um and monica and all these but um she's coming to dallas actually it'll be irving which is about i mean it's in dallas it's a suburb of dallas but that's where the venue is and at one point they were kind of sold out and so i was like oh no i'm missing it and so i looked at houston's tickets to see and those were sold out and so i was like well can't go to houston for it and then i was looking everywhere else that would be like not too far and they were all sold out and so then I just kept checking. I was like, something told me to keep checking because she has a COVID protocol. Like you have to um, either um, show that you're vaccinated or you have to show proof that you've been tested um, within a certain amount of time before you go to the show. And so I was thinking maybe they were releasing a certain amount of tickets every like few days or something like that. So I decided to check back on Saturday and I got a ticket. And so I was so happy about that. And that won't be until March, but I can't wait to uh, vlog me going to that concert. And I bought a ticket by myself. I wasn't waiting for anybody to say they wanna go. Um, and so, yeah, I'm excited, very excited. But I was about to close this video and I started talking about something else, goodness. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this short video. How short is it? It's actually not that short. Wow. I hope you enjoyed this video. I appreciate you all. Don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe, and always, always, always hit that bell notification so you know when I post. Until next time, bye.